you're definitely going to see questions with these multi-atom ions, referred to polyatomic ions. They're made up of a whole bunch of non-metals that overall have some extra electrons. Okay? Almost all of these polyatomics are negative. Okay? There's just one positive ion. And who's got sharp eyes and can find the one positive ion on this whole sheet? Yeah, ammonium. So NH4 plus is a cation, a positive ion, and this can replace a metal. In a ionic compound. All the rest are negative. So all the rest of these ions you're going to see at the end for the negative part. Okay. Occasionally you'll see that. So for this whole course, the ionic compound is always a metal and a non-metal or that guy. That's the only other thing to watch out for is NH4+. Okay. Now the one example I'm choosing to put in my notes uh, of a polyatomic is carbonate. You see carbonate, you go to your sheet, you look it up, it's CO3, and that whole combination has a charge of 2 minus as a group. Okay. And if you have more than one carbonate, you've got to double the whole thing. Okay. And when you go to double the whole thing, you have to use brackets sometimes. Okay. So if we had aluminum carbonate, Carbonate is 2 minus, aluminum is 3 plus, so we've got that 6 lowest common multiple again. So we're going to need 2 of those to get to 6, but we need 3 of the carbonates. I can't just put a 3 here because a number by itself only triples what comes right before it. Okay. I've got to stick a bracket in. part in that horrible bracket to say the whole bracket is tripled. There's three of these carbonates. So this is the one time you're going to see brackets is when you have polyatomic ions and you've got to double or triple that polyatomic ion. This three means there's nine O's in total and there's three carbons in total. Naming wise, it's pretty straightforward. Balancing the charge is a bit more work. The naming, you really don't do anything different. When one of the ions, either the cation or the anion, okay, but the cation is only going to be ammonium. That's the only possibility. Okay. Or the many anion options. If you see those, you just use the unaltered name. Don't switch things to I'd. Don't do anything. Take it exactly as it is in your sheet. Okay. So again, I'm going to see lots. They're pretty much all I'ds and eights. Okay. There's a couple I'ds. Okay. Just don't do anything to it and you'll be fine. So my first one, okay. I've got a metal. I do just like I've been doing all along, name the metal. That's sodium, don't do anything. Then I notice the anion isn't one letter. It's a bunch of things. Okay. Now it can be quite hel helpful when you see a polyatom polyatomic. There's my metal and I'm going to put a line in so I have a nice clear visual. The left side is the positive, the right side has to be the negative. Okay? If you're wondering how to break it up, your first default is metal and everything else. Try to put together. Okay? CO3, you go looking for CO3. You know it has a charge, you can try to figure it out, or if you're not sure, try to find CO3 and, and read its charge off. That's carbonate. 
and I didn't alter at all from how I took it from there. Again, the, the subscripts don't affect the name. So sodium carbonate. Second is uh, LiNO3. Again, we see three different atoms, or three different elements, uh, more than three atoms in total. So you're gonna, I see a metal, and then I see everything else I'm gonna lump together, that NO3. So the metal is lithium. And then the NO3 you look up, NO3 is nitrate, NO3 minus. So that NO3 isn't neutral. Lithium is plus, so that whole nitrate is minus. So lithium nitrate, look good. Now I put in one with brackets, we got CA, three of them, and then PO4, two of those. We have the brackets because there's more than one of those PO4s, which is phosphate. CA is calcium. Okay. The subscripts don't affect the naming. I don't even have to worry about it. Okay. And then I look up PO4 and it's phosphate. Again, don't change that ending. One more to go before you'll be working. So are they good so far? Oh, and I'm, I didn't. So more brackets again. Okay. There's two of those nitrates, but don't let that part confuse you. You get Fe, which is iron. Okay. Okay. Everything else we look up. NO3, which is NO3 minus, is nitrate. Don't change that ending at all. Okay. And you've got that second piece. And are we good? Or not. Something's wrong in D. Yeah, I need a row. See how easy it is to miss and forget? Iron, we just did it. Iron, we have multiple charges. It's really easy to miss. Okay, so just be careful. I flew through those. Sodium has one charge, lithium has one charge, calcium has one charge, iron has more than one charge. So I need a Roman numeral there. Nitrate is minus, is one minus. There's two of them. So minus one and minus one is minus two. So this iron must be the two plus type. So that is the correct name. This is iron 3 nitrate. Okay. 